Hello everyone, Cassandra Good reporting to you live from my vehicle. And guys, this video is all about timing. And this is, and in, I did a video a couple of days ago about timing. But what I mean by this timing is how to position yourself, how to organize yourself. Okay, spacing out time, or if you want to say time blocks. My biggest successes come from when I was able to issue time blocks for myself. My, my time blocks will keep me um, aligned with what is the next project I need to work on. Not so much as the next business, but what is the next project. And I'm going to give you an example. Say example is for me, because I do keep irregular time frames, okay? I, 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 I sleep in spurts, and, um, and people would say I basically take cat naps. To actually sleep a full eight hours, I probably haven't done that in years, um, but I do at least sleep six hours now um, in intervals because of a, a, a health product that I'm using, and I love it. But the time blocks I'm talking about is this. And someone been asking me, you know, how can I do that? Because sometimes the time gets away from me. If you can go to the Dollar Tree, Dollar General, Walmart, wherever it is you want to go, they have these little timers. Now, it is actually a cooking timer. And it has 60, 60 minutes, okay? It, it, it's in intervals of 60 minutes. And what you can do, this helps you to solve making sure that you can organize yourself and get more tasks done in the in the fiscal day. So if you're if you're working your business, say from 10 to 5, 9 to 5, whatever it is that you're working your business, you can regulate your time with that 60 minute timer. And it's a cooking timer. But at least it allows you to be able to do that. That way you don't have to figure out uh, working with your cell phone and trying to, oh, let me put 60 minutes over here for um, Facebook. And let me put 60 minutes over here for um, Twitter. And let me put 60 minutes over. Don't wear yourself out, guys. Some of you all are doing too many things. You are too busy to be effectively busy. Let me say that again. You're too busy to be effectively busy. And what that means is you're trying to do too many things at one time, but you haven't mastered one, okay? So if you can master one, get your time coordinate for that, use that little timer, and I assure you when it goes ding, your mind will program to go to the next thing that you have listed. That is how I'm able to get multiple tasks done on a daily basis for multiple businesses. Okay? Because no, I'm not a, I, I don't have a, a, a super IQ, but my, my IQ is high. But I don't have a genius IQ. I'm not uh, mathematically, you know, brilliant, if you want to say. But I space myself out so that I can have more tasks completed during the course of the day okay now guys I'm telling you this works it works because it worked for me and it's worked for me for years what did it cost me a dollar and seven cents or something like that to get this little timer from the Dollar Tree years ago because that's what was happening. I would get on the phone and I would lose track of time and say, oh my goodness, I have to do this. Oh my goodness, I forgot to do this. Oh my goodness, I forgot to do that. And then before I know it, night then fell and some of the tasks that I set for myself wasn't done. And so of course, it's not enough time in the next day because it wasn't time in that day. How can I get that done the next day? You can't because we can't, we can't take time back. But Many of you are asking me, Cassandra, how are you doing these multiple streams of income and where's the time for it? I assure you, I delegate those time frames right up into that little 60 minute timer I paid do a dollar and some change for. As soon as it said ding, boom, I go on to the next task. And those tasks, like if you, re if you remember listening to me in a couple of my other videos, I still put pen to the paper, and when that task is finished, guess what? I check it off. I check it off. I check it off. Before the end of the day, I have checked off all of my tasks 
that I have set up for myself that day because of that time frame. There are some times that I have delegated to be able to return calls. There are some times I have delegated to, to be able to um, answer my phone, okay? That phone constantly rings, okay? But just imagine this. How precious time is. Just imagine this because there's so many people that want to talk to me. And so many people, trust me, it's not that I don't want to talk to you. But let me tell you about time. Even though a person, I, I pick up the phone and I say, Hello, thank you so much for calling Special Effects Marketing. This is Cassandra. How can I help you? Oh, Cassandra, I've been wanting to speak to you for such a long time. Thank you so much for answering. It's not so much that I don't answer it. A lot of times I'm on the phone with someone else. But the first thing they say is... I don't want to take up much of your time. I just have a few questions. I promise you guys, those few questions go into 20 minutes, 30 minutes, 40, almost an hour. But I don't cut people off because a lot of time they have a lot that they want to get out. And I try my best to give them as much information as I possibly can while they have me on the phone. Because the likelihood of them being able to get me again, they know is little to none. Or if they do, they're catching me. And I mean, they're calling, they're calling, they're calling. I have some people that are relentless. And thank you for being relentless so you can get to me, so I can help you. Okay? But just imagine, I operate my phone lines from 11 to 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If that person took up an hour... That's 12. The next person, I just don't want to take too much of your time. That's another hour. How many people do I get a chance to speak to in the course of those hours of operation from 11 to 7 p.m. Eastern time? Did you count that out? Maybe seven or eight. Some days I'm lucky and I get to speak to 10. Because what ends up happening is they have so many questions. I ask them, if you don't mind, can you get all of those questions together for me and email me and let me answer them in full detail for you? And they are considerate of trying to let somebody else get a chance to speak to me. Because a lot of times people just want to know that I am on that other line. I am on that other extension of that phone and I will actually talk to them. And it's my pleasure to do so because I'm trying my best to help as many people as I possibly can find success. Find their medium for their breakthrough. Okay, so remember timing, get that little time clock, okay, get that little timer, not time clock, I'm sorry, that little timer, 60 seconds, guys, 60 seconds, I assure you, once you start putting your tasks down, writing them down, and, and ding, you can get more work done effectively, and you can find that your productivity is right the way you want it to be, okay? Remember that. Guys, thank you so much for listening in. Again, appropriate that time. Remember, stop trying to do everything. There's not enough time to do everything right out the gate, but master one, get your time synchronized right. Get your tasks done and completed. I promise you, once you do that and organize yourself with your time, you will find your success even quicker even quicker so guys thank you so much for tuning in definitely subscribe to my channel definitely click the link below see if there's anything that interests you and many of you all have been emailing me i woke up this morning and after going to sleep for probably about four or five hours i have hundreds of emails and i will get to you all in short order by the end of the day i do pretty much type pretty quick so i will definitely get you taken care of thank you so much i'm just leaving the gym i appreciate you all and i'll speak to you soon